And the federal government has constituted a task force to investigate nine multi-billion dollar contracts signed with previous administrations. The Minister of Justice, Ababa Kamalami, stated this when he appeared before the Senate Committee on Judiciary, Human Rights and Legal Matters to defend his ministry's 2022 budget. He told the Senate panel that the contracts were in breach of due process. In respect of the P and ID contract, there were about nine contracts that were signed at the same time in breach of due processes and procedure. And they are there, they simply use the P and ID case as a test case. If it had indeed succeeded in taking away $10 billion out of our economy, those other existing contracts that were signed at the same time in breach could have now been contracts that we are content with, in, we are cont I mean, we are faced with in terms of uh, arbitration and associated issues. So the intention of the tax force is just an ad hoc arrangement because if, for example, you localize it to Federal Minister of Justice, and the Federal Minister of Justice was the one comp that was compromised in drafting the agreement, you can't get anything out of it. But then it is about bringing about a comprehensive composition of members responsible that can now look into it. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.